Good afternoon guys, what's up? This is Dan from AAA Backstage. We're here with Booker and Sean from Make Them Suffer. How are you guys doing? Hello. Oh, fantastic, well. thank you. Oh, that's good. So we're at the inaugural Good Things Festival in Australia. You've had uh, Sydney and Melbourne already this weekend. Uh, how about that? Yeah, good. Really good. Really hot. All yeah. That, um, yeah, awesome. Someone, someone took a temperature reading during our set. So Melbourne was 38 degrees Celsius, and then someone took a temperature reading during our set of the on-stage temperature, 52 degrees Celsius. That's that's impossible. Yeah, did you guys just die? Yes. We, yeah. Yes, we passed it. Yeah, I definitely just like passed out on a retreat. Yeah. The fact that you've made it to Sunday is, is an achievement in itself. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Getting iced down afterwards, like water pouring around. <laughs> It would have been quite a different, uh, different you know, climate coming from you know, North America to what you guys just did. Well, we, yeah. we lived, was, when we left uh, Minneapolis, it was, like, it was snowing, it was really cold. Yeah, it was yeah. that bit of a shock. Yeah, it was like, yeah, we all went into a bit of a shock. How, how was that to it? all the Apache boys? It was so yeah. awesome. Fantastic. Yeah, so, yeah, so pretty strong. wild. It well, was it was long, hey. There was like yeah. 37 shows on the tour. It was, you know, we were out for just a little over um, eight eight weeks, if you oh, yeah. count the Japan tour that was yeah, right yeah. before that. So we were stoked to be home, but at the same time, it was so much fun. And yeah, those guys are such legends. Yeah, it must have been awesome to actually tour with you know, bands like that. Did you learn much from them? Or? Definitely, yeah, yeah. Definitely, yeah. Like, I mean, we were I mean, you're always learning things when you're touring. Yeah. You know, yeah. And stuff like that. You can always pick up. You, you, you know, you're doing something wrong if you're not learning something every time you're on tour, basically. But yeah, that, those guys definitely yeah. bought it, both Nico's and Aftermath. Yeah. So yeah, it was wicked watching very nice. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Um, and I, I mean, I, we've all seen you guys a couple times. Um, there's always some interesting shenanigans that go down uh, at your shows. Yeah. Uh, what's, uh, especially, can you give us like a bit of a, an idea as to the difference between, you know, what sort of stuff goes down in, in America and when you come back home? Like, is there much of a difference in, you know, in the crowd and things like that? Yeah, there's no robots yeah. in America. Yeah. But, um, Very odd thing. No shoeies, I imagine. Either. No shoeies. No shoeies. No. Not, not a shoey was down in America. Um, I mean, they get down. They have. They, they have do. fun. They I mean, do. depending on some, some cities more than others, obviously. But I think that's normal. That's yeah. Normal, say, yeah. In Australia. Yeah. But um, I don't know. But it's hard to say because I definitely think the robo so far has been like a festival thing and we have to play any outdoor festival yeah, in America. Yeah, true. So, so you maybe that space. Like, yeah, thing, yeah. So how, how big do you think the robot's going to get today? <laughs> I don't know. We well, if to one, if one pops city. up, I mean, we, we don't call for it or anything. Yeah, it's just, just, mm -hmm. it just has maybe a bit of Uno if we're lucky. Yeah, yeah, yeah that'll be sick. There was, there was a pretty sweet rowboat at the Melbourne one, and I was yeah. like, yeah, it was just so hot on stage, and we just felt so defeated. And then when we saw that going down, we were just like, oh, yes. All right, get to yeah. back up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so good. Yeah. Um, later single just dropped, oh, not just dropped, like that. Yeah. Uh, 27. Um, can you give us a bit of the background? Why, why 27? What's that about? Well, why? Yeah. Um, why indeed? Uh, well, it was like the average age of the people. Yes, it was, it was me, me. Would it be the me or the me? It was the me. Me, me. There you are. And then, um, so there was that, and then also twenty-seven is uh, the decimal value of the binary code which also equals the escape key and the whole like concept of the song is like this internal uh, battle of like man versus machine computer versus uh, human versus AI essentially are someone we just are we just you know and are we all, yeah very cool. Yeah, it's a pretty, pretty filthy song. I think everyone's that's, that's going to go off. I think that's really going off. Is that, is, that a, is that a taste of what we can expect possibly with a, a new album or something? That is, um, it's difficult to say. Um, we've got like, uh, yeah, we've got like a, a number of riffs and we're definitely like... They're pretty dead. Yeah, pretty they're dead. Pretty, that's a good one. Yeah, we're heading into this year reasonably soon and we're going to be working on some new material. Whether or not, uh, 27 is definitely not going to be on the album, yeah. I will say that. Um, but whether or not the rest of the album is going to turn out in that sort of vein, I don't yeah. know. Um, but I think we're going to try and mix it up as much as possible and have a pretty diverse array of yeah, very cool. Yeah. Oh, it's exciting nonetheless. Mm. Um, Alright, now we've got a couple of shit questions. So There's always the fun ones where you, know, you don't have to think too hard. Or yeah, yeah. So if you can pick a number between 1 and 13, I'd be very grateful. Seven. 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 Alright. Ban Rebel Marooned on a remote island. Which one of your band members would be the first one to be eaten and why? Some hard hits. I suppose. Oh. J-Man? Probably J-Man. <laughs> Probably J-Man, because I mean, he's got the most amount of 
Okay. <laughs> <laughs> is it one of those things where it's like, you know, you just have to be faster than, you know, another guy to survive? Is it one of those well, things? Well, I mean... Well, it's just, it's just fair. Like, you know, we won't... It, you know, so let's say we've got, you know, we can live off J-Man for two weeks, whereas, you know, we may only be able to okay, live off so maybe you're going to kill him like, yourself. You know, a couple of days. That's fair. Yeah, no, I think it would come down to a group vote. Okay. I think J-Man I mean, would do the just, honourable thing as well. We've got to do cannibalism real fast, but he's going to get out there. Wait, I thought you said the first one to be eaten. Yeah. I didn't mean by the band, I meant by maybe some wild creatures. Oh, well, that's where my band, band went. Yeah, yeah, for sure. If you yes, want to eat your band, we also have learned a lot now, haven't we? Also, yeah. I've learned a lot about people like that. He's going to be watching this interview afterwards, being like, you know, those glasses. Uh oh. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, good. All right, uh, another number. Anyone but seven. Oh, I said 13. So. Oh, no, 13. All right, here we go. Ooh, okay. Uh, some fellow, uh, some fellow good things uh, people here with us. Would you rather be a member of Baby Metal or Dropkick Murphys in another lab? Oh, Baby Metal, for sure. All day, can tell me why? I like the choreographed dance moves. Yeah. Although I did pity them at the Melbourne show when it was like 38 degrees and they were all doing their choreography and stuff on stage. Yeah. But yes, nonetheless, that was fun. Pretty, pretty epic show from what I've heard. Yeah. yeah. So it should be a bit of fun. Yeah, yeah, for oh, sure. That's awesome. Like everyone cool. wants to be baby. Pretty much. <laughs> purely for that choreographed dance. Yeah. That's so good. Um, any of the acts that you think uh, you know we definitely need to check out today? Oh, as many as possible. We haven't had a chance to yeah. get to see anything. Like we've had to fly back home. I'm oh, sorry, fly back home. Fly to the next city. Like yeah. after every couple of So yeah. Um, Wax, Baby Metal, and Amura on the top of my list, pretty much. Yeah, Baby Metal start 15 minutes before we finish. So, like, I'm just gonna throw my keyboard in the bin <laughs> and run over there and then buy a new one when I get home. So. Oh, that'd be awesome. Well, good luck for today, guys. Thanks for having a chat. Thanks so much for having us. Thanks for having us.